Hello and welcome back to Hapsix Plays Crash Bandicoot and today we're gonna try and beat this episode episode ugh, this level that I rage quit last epi or last time last week excuse me I'm time is becoming a weird construct for me right now but uh, as you can tell I didn't do any kind of life grinding I told myself I was going to. Uh, I guess I'll just go and waste this one. I want the... I want to get him. Uh, I told myself I was going to, and then I ended up not, because, quite frankly, I just got a little busy and didn't have time to really play Crash offline. I did play some games, but it's because I'm... I play more than what I'm recording, so I didn't want to lose... Didn't want to lose out on any of that. So, and uh, what I'm playing outside of recording right now is kind of a kind of a grind. So it's just been a little bit busy, a little hard to. Ah, oh, damn it! Well, I was already a waste. Okay, it's uh, been a little hard to fit in something that I'm recording offline, but I probably should have, especially seeing how things are already going here. I've lost my little my little mask dude who I really uh, I got to thinking, you know, he's kind of like Sparks from Spyro, which makes me think this guy probably has a name. I just don't know what it is. All right, got that. And we're back to that eight. So I'm missing 40. Spin, spin, jump, spin. OK, I didn't need to spin there, but that's all right. Wait for that. And miss. Awesome. I was about to say, it seems like this is going a lot better than last time, but this is no longer a uh, true-ish statement. Oh, I had the mask guy back for a second. That was good, but I lost him. Uh, let's time this better and actually time the distance a little bit. Because this is where it gets kind of challenging as far as this portion of it. Because this is where I have that dude who I somehow got on my first try. That's cool. And I have another life. Spin. Wait. Ah. There goes that life. Oh, I had, uh, had him doubled. I didn't realize that. Well, at least I still have one version of him. Get rid of the monkey before he... I only had trouble with the monkey the one time, and for some reason they still stress me out upon... upon showing up. Not nearly as bad as that fucker does, though. That was awesomely timed. I don't know what I was thinking there. I'm going to call this the warm-up round because there is a, uh, yeah, 0% chance that I'm probably going to make this one. Okay. Boom. Okay. Well, that went a little better. Just don't mess this up nearly as bad. There we go. Got a new checkpoint. Boom, boom. Spin on the turtle. Jump past that. Run up. Jump. Run up. Jump. Oh, this is the one that gave me all sorts of problems last time. How many lives do I have left? A whopping zero. Just what I wanted to see. Wait. Don't get too cocky. Okay, got him. Run past. 
Life. I'll take it. I'll take it. I'll take it. Uh. Okay. This. I think this is. Yeah, further than I made it last time. I think when I rage quit, I didn't even make it this far. So, already doing slightly... Well, <laughs> that happened, but that's okay. Already doing slightly better, and I did gain two more lives. Ideally, here in a minute, I'm going to gain a third. So it's not quite going to make up for everything I've already lost. Well... I think it'll get me back to four. Oh, sweet. I don't even care that she got taken. How am I doing on lives now? Okay, yeah, that got me back to four. And I'm close, actually, to getting a fifth one because of apples. I don't think... I'll actually... Ah, damn it. No! Okay. I don't think I'll get it. I just... I don't... Well, I might. I don't know. We'll see. If I can do this on my first try, as opposed to... What happened last time, I will be... Super grateful. Grab... Get back to it. Miss! That's fine, too. I am fine if I have to reclimb up this this time because it gets me the... Ah, oh, damn it. I'm not fine doing this, but that's my fault. I'm fine reclimbing it this time if I have to because it means that I got the, the apples that I need for life. So, it's just going to prolong this level, which, honestly, I don't really know what... I mean, I don't know anything about this game, so I don't know what's coming after this level. Grab the mask. And I missed an apple. Well, that was something. Go back. Go back. Get that. Go back up. Is it worth trying to get the one apple? I mean, my at? 85. Shit. Ah, shoot. Yep. Saw that coming. Oh, hey. I did it that time. That's good. Okay. Get the jump. It's one. Oh, it looks like I did get the apple. That's good. Ah, shoot. Okay, well, reclimb. Really bad with the metal boxes. I think I said that last week, but I'm really bad at aiming with those. I hope. Fuck. I hope. Okay, let's try all of that again, including the sentence. I hope that this is the last set of having to jump up like that because I just, I really suck at it. And get back up. I think that's the last one, too. I, If I remember correctly, I think I did make it to the end. Like, if not the end, I could see the end. Okay. Yeah, if not the end, then I could see the end last time. Ah, oh, shit. Worth it. Uh, maybe not completely worth it, actually. <laughs> I made it, and I saw those... What was it six extra apples? And boy, oh boy, was six worth it. Because now I'm only five away, or I guess six away from a new life. That if the top proves to be as challenging for me as it was last week, then I'm going to need every bit of those five lives. Come on. Let's make this in one this time. Checkpoint. All right. That guy do his thing. Oh, I'm going to get six easy here. Just got to boom. Take 
that. Ah, oh, I hit him. Ooh, I think that guy was one of the problems, too. Got lucky there. Uh, this was a problem also, if I remember correctly. I do remember correctly. Ah, uh, this is... a whole other problem. Okay, take it. Okay. Let them do their things. Take it. Hit the checkpoint. Bless. Okay. I think I made it this far. I think, yeah, I think this is where I lost it last time. I think either that or I hit the fire. It's all right, I've got least four more chances for the monkey wish my mask dude would come back uh, trying to time this is a nightmare okay Oh, two more lives. Oh, I don't think I made it this far. So that means I didn't see the ending last time. I just hoped that I did. Ah. Oh. Okay, so I think I have to skip the middle one. I think that's the, the trick. So I'll have to skip the middle, jump straight to that third one, and hopefully that will get me home free. Gotta wait one more cycle. Ah, okay. Back down to four, so I'm not feeling as good as I was a second ago. Just, ah, oh, the timing of this. My thumb's starting to hurt, too. Having to hold down on X. Ah, oh, see, that would have been a good one to go. Whew. Let that one do its thing. I'm gonna fall apart at the end. I can already see it happening. I can literally just see me falling apart. Okay. I should be right after this one. Or not. Uh, oh shit, that almost fucked me up real bad. Fat fingering is a terrible thing here. I'm just gonna hang out here for a second. Okay, that worked. Go for it. Ah, I should have waited. I should have waited. Take it. Spin. Don't get stuck here nearly as long as last time. Oh, I have the life guy. And I lost him. Spin. Not gonna get lives on this, I don't think. Yeah, it's not gonna be that kind twice in a row. Jump. Jump. How am I doing? Two. Okay. And this is where I have to skip. Jump. Or not. Okay, now I'm really curious. Jump. Try and hold on to my life, dude, then, so that way I can... That way I can maybe... Yeah, maybe take the hit now. Okay, okay. Made it back here pretty easily. Which is not quite there, but... I wonder how they uh, got this architecture set up. That's a pretty impressive... 
pretty impressive little system they got going. Oh, it knocked me off. Okay, I see the problem. I am doing the long jump. I need to hop across them. Now is not the time to test when to hop, but I think I figured it out. Which is uh, pretty bad because I just lost my little jump, boom, run up. Come on, give me life. Be nice. Come on, game. All right. Yep, that sounds about right. This is like white knuckle, palm sweat inducing stress right now. Okay, I need a long jump to it. Hop, hop. How the fuck? Yeah, I know. Ah, fucking. Yeah, retry. Well, at least I didn't spin those apples away. Ah, fucking hell. Ah, shit. You know what? I'm going to try without. I don't want to waste a life on that dude. He's probably not going to make it that far for me anyway. If I die before I get to... If I do that, that's fine. At least the apples carry over. Ah. And this, there's no way this is the hardest level or even remotely close to the hardest. So I am in for the rude awakening that I expected out of this game the entire time. This is just a simple taste of what's to come. And it is a very mad hapsix. This game deceived me. I thought I was doing pretty good and then it decided to tell me no. Jump. Checkpoint, that guy, jump. First one of these. Let's go. I need that because I think that got me two lives. Hopefully the two lives before that are there also, so that way I can get ideally all of them. Checkpoint. Spin, spin, jump, jump. And let Monkey do his thing. I think that was a life last time too, and I, it's not anymore. Spin. So that means if that's not the two that I'm thinking of, probably are either. Let that fire. Ah, shoot. All right. Oh, fucking hell. Are you serious? Oh, I forgot I died at the onset there, too. So I'm already down the two. And... Gosh, you gotta be, like, lightning fast. There we go. Got him. Let that do its thing. Now, jump. Yep, they're not lives. Shit. 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 I missed. Am I gonna do an entire another episode of me just failing at this one? 
It's starting to look that way, dear listeners. All right. Curve him. Also, if you guys hear anything random in the background, it is probably the contractors at the apartment next door. We're all getting new windows. Fuck. We're all getting new windows, and they are rather loud. It's the exact same as last time, where I can't make it even back to that top section on my second go. I get better at that, though. Shit. Okay, don't go fast here. Oh, I got a life. Uh, that's because of... Because of apples. Okay. Please. I think her name's Coco. Give me a couple lives. Because I'm going to fucking need them. Or I can die right away. That's, that's cool, too. And we're going to try that again. One life. Two lives. So two extra lives. Not going to be enough apple-wise, but it jumped me up to three. How are we doing on apples? Twelve. I'm going to take every single apple I can get because I don't think there's even enough left in the level to get me to 99 again. All right, let's not give that thing time to reset, actually. Take them, um, land on it. Okay. I've had pretty good aim this time. Until there. But that's fine. So where am I at? Uh, 23 of 48. That's roughly half. But I already know that I can't get them all in this level because I even saw one of those little things that indicate that there's a special path. Oh, fuck. How long have I been doing this? About 20 minutes. So even if I fail, I've still got another another round I can probably do pretty easily. Maybe two if needed. I'm really hoping it's not going to be needed. Fuck. Fuck! I really wish YouTube wouldn't hate me that I could just name one of these episodes Fuck. Okay, jumping, jump. Let's make that this time. Nicely done. Nicely done. And it's go time. I'll take that. That was a really good one. I'll jump on the turtle to get all of those apples too. Die. Goodbye. Good night. I wonder if that's what that's there for, so you can jump high right off the bat with him. I might have jumped too soon there. Nope. Okay. Well, that's fun. My thumb is really hurting from this. Fuck. Not only did I lose my mask, I also... Woo! Okay, that was not the time to experiment with that. I've learned better. There goes those two lives I just excitedly got. I take those because I need them. See, I'd be at like 60-something and feeling a, like slightly better. Him, let those go. Get rid of that guy. Boom. Why did that not jump? Fuck. Fuck. Go for it. Hmm. I know. I know. I know.
If this entire episode is me failing at this, I want to applaud any of you who continue to watch, because this is just... It's just not, uh... Not my game. It's not my game. I actually have, uh... Sh- strong feelings that have changed on this game. I was thoroughly enjoying it. I was like, in my downtime, playing some of the speed runs. Uh, my girlfriend would come home just to be watching me play, not even realizing that I was just repeatedly doing the same things because I've been recording. And now it's just turned to where I almost don't even want to turn it on because this one level, one level, is enough to make me hate this game. And I know, and the reason I say that is because I know it's not the worst. There's no way, there's a 0% chance this is the hardest level in the game. So I am just kind of in for a long haul now. I went from thoroughly enjoying this to like begrudgingly playing it. I actually, uh, it's edited out because I I always start recording before I get, to the intros, obviously, and uh, I always record a little bit at the onset, I accidentally pulled up Mass Effect 2 to continue that run, and then I realized, oh wait, no, today I'm recording Crash. I recorded Mass Effect yesterday, which means it's Crash Day, and I'm just, yeah, it's, it is what it is, it is exactly what it is. I really wish all of those extra lives reset to be extra lives. I don't know why they did between episodes. I guess the save, like, leaving after saving did it. But the fact that I have to just deal with apples now when I got extra... Well, it's the first death. Uh, When I got extra lives earlier is a little uh, frustrating, to say the least. Get out of here. And I missed. I knew it as soon as I hit jump. As soon as I started leaning forward, I was like, fuck, I missed it. Go ahead and skip that. Ah, oh, hate this guy. Okay, let that do its thing. Jump. Let that do its thing. Go past it. Time this correctly. Okay, let that do its thing. Get out of here. Get the monkey. Jump over here. Go get some extra lives. How am I? Uh, so two, and I have 18, 65. All right. I should for sure get the two lives here, and on my way up, get another one, which means I should, if I make it to the top... I'll do that. I always fail on that first one for some reason. If I make it to the top, I should have five lives. Now, I should make it to the top. I don't think there's anything between. Almost forgot about that. Uh, I don't think there's anything between now and me getting to the top that'll kill me. And then it's just a matter. Wow. Just a matter of trying to finish the level. I wish that the loading screen... Like, I'm glad the loading screens aren't, like, too long, but I kind of wish they were slightly longer so I could read what those tips say. I've thought about when I do my watchbacks just pausing so I can actually stop to read it for a second. 68. Let's climb this, which... These are just annoying. Like, it's not even like this is that difficult. It's just really easy to miss if you're slightly off. And then you have to redo the whole thing, which, like I said, that's just annoying. That's not, like, bad. Ooh, almost overshot it. I never overcorrect. I was undercorrect. Jump. All right, this is where I'm going to miss. Yep. Might as well. You do that quickly. Jump, jump. I'm not gonna go for that one apple. I decided. Last 
time I told myself I would, this time I'm saying, ah, it looks like the apple's not there again. One apple isn't worth it. Six, on the other hand, most definitely is. Okay, let that guy turn around, because I can jump on him to get another life. I should be high enough. Oh, yeah. Boom. New life. Get rid of you. Let that thing do its thing. Here we go. Get rid of this guy. Right away, too. Let those go up. And back down. Crush him. Okay, wait. I probably could have done it, but... Okay, I should be getting close to another... Should be getting close to a checkpoint. Ooh, almost spun off getting the checkpoint. And I'm sitting here with five lives. Missing 22 boxes, which is stressful. Kind of hate that I lost... Yep, really hate that I lost my mask, dude. That's all right. Let that shoot. Oh, shouldn't have done that. I got lucky there. I'm going to be honest. Completely honest. Come on, game. Be nice. Or give me a bunch of apples. That's cool, too. Okay, wait, go, spin, oh. so what happened there was I fat fingered the uh, PlayStation button on the controller and the game doesn't pause, so that in turn resulted in me not being able to move Crash while I was trying to not slide off, resulting in him falling, resulting in me dying and losing one of those very, very important lives. Okay. Jump, spin, wait, wait, go, boom. Ah. I think I need to be going while the fire is still out. Like, just to get the timing right, because it's just... That timing is way too wonky. I was there! And there's enough crates left in this level to make me feel that's not the end. <sighs> Shit. And I'm out of lives again. Okay. That dude's thing. I made it! Oh, fucking hell, are you serious? It is also the furthest I've been, and the most terrifying, because I... Oh, God bless. They know how bullshitty this is. I don't even care that I have to redo all of this. I just got four lives, which might, might bear in mind, be enough to carry me through to the end. Uh, okay, well, I'm fine with that. I'm still reeling at the fact that I shouldn't be reeling. They know what they made. They know their product. Shit. Keep in mind, this game was for kids. Like, I think it's a testament to show how much harder games used to be. Like, kids today, especially little kids, like, the target audience for this game when it was made was, like, 
Yo, play. Oh, shit. Take the apples. I'll take the hit. I'm gonna go. I'm going for the apples. This game was made for, like, you know, the playground kids. Like, I remember, you know, I was playing Spyro pretty young, and that was. It was kind of like there were the Spyro players and there were the Crash players. My friend was a Crash Bandicoot player. I mean, you're talking maybe. Oh, like first grade. If that, I'd have to check. I forget what year they came out. But I know it was like. Uh, prime example. I know for I know for a fact Spyro 2 was not out when I played Spyro 1. And I was a kid. So it it was made for that age group, and there's all these challenges in it that games made for kids today, they just don't have. I think Nintendo still does a good job putting out that kind of difficulty because, you know, they're... St they're fuck! They're still releasing things like Mario and Legend of Zelda and stuff like that, where it's just always been kind of baked into the formula, but by and large, a lot of the, like, newer games designed for kids, they got rid of these kinds of, like, major challenges. This is something I would have had to call a cousin or something to come do for me because I just would not, would not have been able to do it. Okay, I was really hoping that I was going to land me back on the metal guy, but I think I heard the end of the level there, so I think this is just a make this final climb and the challenges are done kind of deal shoot okay restart uh but it's i don't know it's something that i feel i mean most kids now are playing a lot of the online games which i already think is something pretty toxic hell i mean i don't even support the idea of kids doing what I'm doing, of recording this and putting it on YouTube. I mean, it'd be terrible for their self-esteem because I'm not doing super great at it, but I'm just doing it for me and for fun. I'm not expecting to become, like, internet YouTube famous because I decided in my, like, couple months before turning 30, I'm just gonna play these games and put them on YouTube. I, shoot, I have, like, one subscriber, and I still average about 15 views a video, I think, which is pretty, actually, a lot better than I expected, but I'm not going on that tangent, I'm just saying, like, the whole online gaming community is definitely not something I think kids should be involved in, and, like, honestly, if you're a parent, and for some reason you're checking this out, and, or if you're a kid and you want to tell your parent about this channel and you play Fortnite, shame on you, and also, why the fuck are you listening to me? I cuss, like, every 30 seconds, particularly in this game. So, get off Fortnite, go pick up Spyro, something, oh, hey, another life. Something much more designed for your age group, and I beat the level. Fuck yes. Yeah, I don't care how many crates hit me. 11's better than I expected. Continue. And I think I'm done with the islands. So I don't know what's going to happen now. Oh, I teleport. That's what happened, I guess. Uh, huh? Ah, it just moves. That's cool. Um, well, you know what? I made it to a new location, so I'm going to say let's go ahead and end the episode here. Thank you guys so much for watching. As always, feel free to like, subscribe, and share in any more locations so we can stay updated on content. I am still releasing Crash Bandicoot on Fridays, and if you're liking what you're seeing, go ahead and click that video there in the corner. Go back to the beginning, see what got us here, and go ahead and check out my channel. I have completed Mass Effect 1. I'm currently playing Mass Effect 2, like I referenced a little bit ago, and pretty soon I'm going to be launching in the Persona 3 as well. So it's going to be great, and I hope you guys can check it out, enjoy the content, leave a comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. But as always, stay safe, and I will see you next time.